Hey, good morning, Hot Riders. Today I'm uh, still working on four bands. And uh, what I'm going to try to do, I can quit moving this camera right here, is I'm still cutting out the bed. So I'm going to, this is uh, behind the driver's seat back here. I'm going to cut up to here, come out over here, and I'm going to get into the seat pan. And I'm going to start drilling the spot welds if I can, if I can see them on a seat pan. And I'm going to kind of migrate to getting all the seat pan out. And still, uh, this metal here, I'm probably just going to go ahead and go to the factory seam up here. Cut this out, drill some spot welds. So I can put most of that uh, full length uh, left side floor pan in. So that's what we're working on today. I'm gonna try to get the seat pan out today. And you can see I've drilled all my spot waves out of here. I've kind of cut it right there, made it smaller, and got it raised up here. But uh, this back, I just wanted to show you the back. Uh, it's really hard to see where the spot waves are. And I took these out of my wagon, my 63 wagon, I don't remember uh, being welded like this but so probably what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come in here and I'm gonna cut this out and then I'm gonna cut maybe some little slits and I'm gonna break this off and do that all the way across so I didn't want you to think I wasn't doing nothing while I was waiting on my Catalina so that's what we're doing today this project's kind of drug out too long sorry about the camera there it's drug out too long so at least I want to get my uh, everything out and the pans in and maybe just fit it tacked. Oh yeah. Yeah, we're getting there. The reason I was cutting at angle was I can get my wheel in here deeper and I can cut back further with my grinder if I'm cutting in here at angle than cutting straight in. Straight in I'll run into this. So I'm gonna see if I can get the so I can see y'all down right here. Maybe you're sitting on the drive shaft. So now what I'll do is I'll just grab pieces of this and come in here and try to break this off. I may have to grind some more. We can see what that's doing there. Let's see that'll get in there. It may show me too where the spot weld is and I'm going to drill it out. So I'm going to turn the camera off. I'm going to miss this while. I'll show you what I got. So I figured 1968, when I was putting this car together, they told one of them union guys, hey, when you get done doing this, you don't have to go mount tires. He probably said, I ain't mounting tires. I'm a welder. So he just put multiple 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 spot welds in this thing all the way across here instead of having nice neat spot welds that we just drill out and pop off i mean all of this is just weld weld everywhere and it may be what they had to do i don't know but it's really aggravating so when i started this i didn't realize this was gonna be welded that much so what I would do next time if it was me is I would just come in here. What I will do next time since this is me is I think I'd just cut right here along this and leave this, leave this metal on top, and then just pop my holes in my seat pan and weld down to this instead of trying to clean all this off. Because I mean that's the job. If it was spot drilled the way the the rest of it is. It wouldn't be that much trouble. But like I said, what I would do is just come in here and cut right along here, 
just down through and leave this metal on there. Grind that up, clean that up, and then just spot weld to this because it's just a lot of a lot of welds in there. Okay, finally, I'm starting to fit my rear seat pan, which uh, you know it's not gonna be a lot of fitting. I mean, I've got everything cut out, so looks like it's gonna lay down there pretty good. I marked this pan. Show you right here. So I marked this pan right here. You can see the white mark across here. And this is where uh, the metal brace underneath there is going. So I need to come in here and drill some holes in that uh, so I can uh, spot weld that to that brace. Well, our seat band is ready to weld. Uh, it's okay. I'm pretty happy with it. So I can come in here and just uh, I ground all that smooth underneath this patch panel and uh, punch the holes in there. I sprayed that with a weld through primer. And same thing up front. Got the holes in here. Holes in here. And ground all the brakes underneath. And spray the weld through primer. So I'm going to start welding her up. I'm glad to get this done. But then I just got the this big panel. Which will take me maybe forever. <laughs> A couple of months. <laughs> 